Hey, what's up, guys? You're on me, Tree Boy for Life. This is one of the coolest things. My buddy had an old koi fish pond, but you, if you just look around, it's pretty big. I mean, it's the way it was because I helped him dig it out, but it kind of at the bottom it goes and then it dips down. He was trying to get it to dip so the herons wouldn't get in, but eventually, because it used to go down and go into the pond down here, but he just decided it was just too much maintenance and everything. They had everything set up to pump and everything up here. But if you look in here now, what normally tends to happen, you'll see a million tadpoles. They don't take, I'm talking about frogs like the the plague on the Egyptians <laughs> from the Bible. It's like a million tadpoles up in here. Some of them died. They're going to want just floating around. But they in there everywhere. I'm telling you, everywhere you turn, you can see movement. I go to show you about how frogs are. So you can just imagine how many frogs are going to come out of here. And that's from here to there. This is probably about, give or take, about 5, 10, about 10 foot. Last time I came, there was some over here too. Let me see if this thing dried up at all. But they was in this little container. Let me see if there's still anything in here. Oh yeah, look at those little small ones. See them in there swimming around? If I can hold it steady. They look like little sperm. <laughs> That's what they look like. I should have dumped them into the big pond, but I probably might leave them alone. You can see them swimming in there if I don't stir the water up too bad. There's a little tiny one. There he goes over there. You can see him moving a little bit. There he goes. See him over there moving? It's pretty cool, ain't it? Just everywhere. Probably some over there in that one, too. They'll probably be eating the mosquitoes up. See how close I can get before they start moving.